Hey guys, welcome back to Jurassic Collectibles. I hope you all had a happy holidays and a happy new year to you. Some of you may know that uh, I'm a huge fan of this prop in particular. It's the Jurassic Park Night Vision Goggles. And uh, this particular pair, uh, called the Goat Finders Mark I, uh, were actually a pair that I fabricated myself in 2017. If you haven't seen the video for that, link is down below. But last year, uh, I actually released the files for free uh, so that people could download uh, the STL for those files and actually 3D print them themselves. And I've had a flurry of messages from uh, my fellow goggle smiths out there making night vision goggles. And one in particular recently really caught my eye. Uh, it was from uh, Matt Yeager. He sent over a message explaining some of the upgrades he'd made to his goggles. And I thought it was awesome. So I kindly asked him to shoot some video, which he kindly did. And uh, he's gonna run through some of his cool upgrades uh, to share with you. I hope you enjoy this, I know I did. And uh, stay safe guys, and I'll see you soon. Today we are gonna be going over the upgrades I have made to the Jurassic Park night vision goggles. The first upgrade I made was limiter switches for the motors when they zoom in and out for both lenses. By adding limiter switches, the plastic gear on the lens and the metal gear on the motor no longer grind when zooming in or out. This saves the functionality of the night vision goggles and allows them to last much longer. The second upgrade I made was adding inductive LEDs in the light rings that circle around the lenses. In previous versions, the wires used to light the LEDs would get tangled with the motor spinning in and out and cause wire breaks and damage and binding. Here you can see that the wireless inductive LEDs, if placed within a half an inch to an inch inside or outside of the copper ring, they light up. This is a 5 volt system and an 80 millimeter ring that fits quite nicely inside the front yellow lens cap. Once glued in place, the LEDs go inside the green ring. Here you can see the limiter switches stopping the motors from over zooming out and back in. With these two upgrades, this latest version is the best one yet. You can get inductive LEDs on Amazon, and you can also pick up the limiter switches on Amazon. Both are relatively cheap, and what a great prop you can make. Thanks for your time, and I hope you enjoy the video. <laughs> 